resort and spa. Now, this place has the biggest, probably the biggest sculpture that Disney created out of gingerbread, the life-size gingerbread house. This one, and this is the back portion of the gingerbread house. Now, this piece, literally, piece, did I say piece? Piece literally took 10,000 pieces of gingerbread to make and decorate, and all of this stuff is a recipe from Austria. And this house has a pin from um, Mary Poppins Little Penguins that show up in the movie. Picture right here. And I'm not really sure what pin means, so you can just let me know what that means in the comments below because I don't know what pin means. All I know is that I wish I ate this house before I um, baked a, a, a lot of cookies because I baked a lot of cookies. A tutorial come out, a tutorial will come out of that very, very soon. And I, I just think that this gingerbread house belongs in Rapunzel's village or in Belle's village because to me it seems like it can go with the theme of the village or structure that goes with their, their villages and to me it just really blends in. Also I imagine the baker from the Tangle series, this guy, I imagine him baking this because his creations are quite beautiful. And if y'all haven't seen the series, I will link to one of the episodes down in the description below or in the comments because I always forget to put it in the description. Watch it is so good. It makes you laugh and it sometimes makes you cry. I know one of them made me cry. And I don't know. I don't know what else to say about it. Oh, I love gummy bears and it had gummy bears in it. So that is a win-win for me. Now we're traveling to the beach where you can find this little carousel right here. And this carousel has Lilo and Stitch inspired Sorry, inspired horses. Now the horses, I don't really see anything. I don't really see anything Lilo or Stitch theme. 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 So I don't really know if if it's actually Lilo and Stitch theme or if they're just talking about something else in the carousel. So I don't really know. And it's also panned by Lilo and Stitch. And this beach club is is celebrating 18 years, so it's their 18th anniversary, and there's 18 hidden Mickeys in this carousel. Tell me in the comments below if you found them already. This carousel was hand-painted, and it actually spins. But i rather um, eat it than write. Because I love to eat. Who doesn't love to eat? Raise your hand if you don't like to eat. I'm just kidding. I love to eat. Eat is my favorite thing to do. Eating should be a sport because it's a lot of work. Because right after I eat, I film videos because that's when I'm so energetic. I'm always energetic, but that's when I'm hyper. I'm hyper. I'm hyper. I'm hyper. To one of my special viewers right there, right there, they're, they, they, this year, blah, 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 I'm stuttering. This year, they made a Cinderella Castle gingerbread formation Mayor, what was her name? Mary Blair style castle gingerbread thing. Picture right here. And supposedly that Prince Charming and Cinderella greet the guests when they see the gingerbread castle. Now I'm not really sure because in this picture they show Prince Charming and Cinderella as little cookies. But I'm not really sure if they mean it like that or do they mean it like physical Prince Charming and physical Cinderella. I don't really know. But all I know is that sounds so magical. Anything Cinderella castle themed is just very magical. Cinderella is a very beautiful icon of the Disney world. They used Molly chocolate and it's 18 feet tall. Now we are traveling to Africa where in the Animal Kingdom we can find in the Tusker House Restaurant a three foot African inspired marketplace. Now I couldn't exactly find a picture that I think and I was assertive that it was actually the actual gingerbread creation. This is all I could find. I'm not really sure if this is it. I'm not really sure. Let me know in the comments below if I'm right or wrong because I couldn't find another picture of it. So, this is what I could find. It's 25, wait, 25 pounds altogether is 25 pounds. It's made of dark chocolate, bread flour, sugar, and plenty of holiday spirit. And I really do see that. This the little snowman and the little icons of Christmas is super adorable and, and the most amazing touch. Who doesn't want a little frosty snowman on their Disney tree? I, I would want one. Why do I buy one for my tree? 
Next, we are going to the United States Capitol building at Epcot, the um, American, um, the American Pavilion. Now, this little thing right here, this little beautiful, beautiful representation of the United States building, is 50 pounds in total. It has handcrafted Christmas trees. It has six hidden Mickeys. Like I said, if you found those, let me know in the comments down below if you see on the hidden Mickeys. And the thing I love about this um, little, not little, why do I keep saying little? The thing I love about this creation is that um, they put like frost or snow or icing basically that dripping down on the building that makes it look like it's snowing. And when, if you see the Frozen Castle show, I mean, I love that. Every time I see this, I think of this. It's just so beautiful to me. And also, I just love the little colors on it, especially the mashup of the red and the white. It looks like candy cane, but red and white is our American colors. It's a beautiful combination of Christmas in America. Beautiful. And last one, unfortunately, they made a, I almost said Haunted Mansion again, the Nightmare Before Christmas little shack house. And this, I just love it. I love a busy art where you can just walk around and you see a different detail every single time. And I just also love that Oogie Boogie's in the background. For don't forget your villains are in the holidays. Just because they're evil doesn't mean they don't like Christmas. You never know. Don't judge a book by its cover. Well, y'all, that's all I have for you today. I'm sorry if this is a really rant video. I'm sorry if I'm just all over the place. But I just really wanted to make this video for y'all. I love you so much. Bye.